I'm Katrina. You're watching Dante's Boxing Nation. Final one, just the latest on Devin Haney. Have you spoke to Devin recently? Yeah, I spoke to uh, Bill actually. Where are we now? Friday, Wednesday. Um, we're going to get an offer into Jojo Diaz. Um, there's other fights we're looking at as well. Richard Comey is a fight they've talked about. They'd be happy to take. So Devin's not a problem. Bill's not. They'll, they'll fight absolutely anyone. I haven't even got to ask them. So it looks like late October, early November, you'll see Devin back in the ring. And here we go again. Dante's Boxing Nation, what's going on, guys? So you all know the story by now. Jojo Diaz, he was fighting in a title eliminator to fight for Devin Haney's belt. After he beat Fortuna, he called out Ryan Garcia's name first. He said, I want Ryan Garcia or Devin Haney. Once Devin Haney started to put pressure on the mandatory Jojo Diaz to take the title shot, that's when Jojo Diaz, he started to tell the public that he wants the Devin Haney fight. Matter of fact, I'm going to put the image up. He tweeted, quote, I want Devin next. I'm going to do everything possible to make that fight happen. And then later on, JoJo said whoever agrees to take the fight out of Ryan Garcia and Devin Haney is who he will be fighting next. So now we see that Eddie Hearn, Devin Haney's promoter, has sent him an offer. Ryan Garcia hasn't sent him an offer. And JoJo hasn't sent anyone an offer. The only person who has sent out an offer is Devin Haney's people. So when Jojo Diaz says he's going to do whatever it takes to make this fight, here's your opportunity. The champion is sending you an offer when once again, Ryan Garcia hasn't even sent an offer out. We've already heard Jojo say out of his own mouth that Ryan Garcia does not want the fight. So once again, what is the holdup with Jojo Diaz? Guys, do you know that Jojo Diaz, he made $300,000 in his last fight against Fortuna? When Devin Haney made $3 million in his last fight against Linares. And Ryan Garcia, he made $500,000 in his last fight. So you know what that means? That means that Jojo Diaz, he stands to make more money than he has ever made in his career if he fights against the champion, Devin Haney. In fact, he will make more money fighting against Devin Haney than he would make fighting against Ryan Garcia. You hear people talk about Ryan Garcia's uh, followers on Instagram, but we already know that his following on Instagram does not translate to him getting big numbers, getting big views. Because if that were the case, Ryan Garcia would already be on pay-per-view like Jake Paul is. The reason why so many people tune in and buy Jake Paul's pay-per-views is because 80% of those people tuning in are his subscribers. But that's not the case when it comes to Ryan Garcia. And this is the reason why even Oscar De La Hoya has said that those Instagram followers have not translated over to Ryan Garcia's boxing fan base. So Jojo Diaz, he has no excuse to turn down this fight, especially when it was him that said he's going to do whatever it takes to make this fight. Let's see what Jojo Diaz says now that Eddie Hearn has actually sent out an official offer to him. With that being said, I'm going to go ahead and leave you guys with this clip with Bill Haney talking to Jojo Diaz directly, trying to make this fight come to fruition. Check it out, guys. That's all I got for now, and I'm on to the next one. Uh, uh, yeah, Haney, um, I, I really appreciate you guys, man. I, I know uh, Devin Haney is a hell of a fighter, and I respect you guys as well, and I respect that you guys are willing to accept the challenge as, as in myself because I know I ain't no slouch or I ain't no, I ain't no uh, push around, and I'm going to come out there and bring it to you guys. And uh, It's going to be one hell of a fight for the fight fans, and I'm really, really looking forward to it. I really want to make this shit happen. Um, I already talked to MTK and I already talked to my team about it to push forward on, on this fight because I know that it's a mandatory fight and I'm the type of person that is not going to back down from any type of, you know, mandatory position. So 
this fight is definitely going to be made. We just got to make sure that everything is in place and we, we make sure that uh, everything is just perfectly set. I feel like a fight with me and Devin Haney, we could actually sell that bitch out at, at the MGM in Las Vegas, man. And it'll be something that we could generate some serious money. But not only that, give the fight fans an exciting, uh, brilliant fight, man. So I just want to make sure that everything is, is executed right because I feel like this, this time in my life and... In Devin Haney's life, we just gotta maximize and and do the most and do the most for for both of our careers. And I think that if if we if we actually execute it the right way and the the, the way that I feel like it is is planned, and and I know that you, you you see the same vision, I really think that we can make something popping, man. And I'm really looking forward to it. Uh, absolutely, absolutely. And listen, um, I, I I always told them, I said first and foremost, we gotta give you. The respect and the position that you earned, brother. You had a we had a wonderful fight down there. You know, I watched it. You know what I mean? Um, you know, you, you you put on a put on a great clinic on that boy. You know what I'm saying? So I, we, we we yeah, I really and I really enjoyed it. And you're 100 percent right. And the days and you know you were very vocal and 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 I we loved it. You know what I'm saying? Dev went to talking to you and shit like that. And this is a fight that you tell. The people you tell your people just like you like you said this is the fight we're making Devin is telling the people that his people this is the fight that he's making and we don't have no problems you know what I mean we don't exactly let, yeah we don't I, let, I don't we have don't no let problems none of the at get aside get us let, and we don't let nothing get 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 a sidetrack you know what I'm saying exactly and, not yeah. not this fight is definitely going to be made because at the end of the day it's it's what I say and it's what Devin Haney says and uh yeah. I think that we're both on the same on, on the same position um, I, uh, you know, you know how the boxing game works, man. I respect both you and Devin Haney. Yep. Um, you got, you got to talk that <laughs> shit. You got to back it up, and that's Appreciate that's what we're both on right now, man. It's it's just all love at the end of the day. But we know that we got to we got to excite the fans, and we got to give give the fans what they want to see. And oh, absolutely. Um, at the end that's of the day, man, when we're in that ring, man, when we're in that ring. It's blood, sweat, and tears, man. So it's it's anything goes once you're inside that ring. So I'm just very very excited. Once we get the opportunity to go out there and put on a great performance, man, it's going to be a brilliant performance, and uh, I, I, I'm really looking forward to it, man. So let's try to lock it in. I, I, I just got to make sure that my my eyes my eyes okay. Uh, I got I got a doctor's appointment uh, next week, so I just want to make sure that I'll be healthy and, and ready to go by maybe um, early November, uh, late November, so we can make something happen. Okay. Fellas, I've got some great news for you. If you've lost your hair or have a receding hairline, the time has come when you can finally get your hairline back through a process called scalp micropigmentation. So here's how it works. It's a hair tattoo that replicates the look of your hair follicles when you have fully shaved it down. So to get this hookup, make sure you follow and contact my man Scalp Carolinas on Instagram. Contact them at 704-499-3471 and make sure you follow them on Instagram. All right, now check this out, guys. If you're looking to repair eczema scars, burns and bruises, dark spots and blemishes, then this right here is the perfect product for you guys. It's called L.O. Dekey Face and Body Oil. Athletes and top ranking boxers, they're also using it after training to reduce swelling, inflammation and to ease the pain. So get yours today. Go to lodekey.com, like them on Facebook and follow them on Instagram.